Hello. It's here. I'm going to try to make this quick. I have like 10% on my phone, and I always do my video with my phone. It says do not bend. Right up there is Chic Sparrow. I wasn't going to open this because I actually have another um, small, I don't know, a personal size planner coming in from another company. But you know what? Chick Sparrow needs a video all its own as far as I'm concerned. This is from the launch of the Outlander books. I love the Outlander books. But to be honest, I only got through three of them. Because after a while, it's like, ah, you need a break. So I'm taking a break. My break's extended to five years, but ah, that's okay. All right, this is their new packaging. This I already got something with this kind of packaging in it. Um, it was, I think, a weekly. Okay, let's see what we've got here. It's pretty. This really got beat up a little bit. The other one I have is um, in better shape, but mm, no matter. I still like it. And I've got these all over the place. <laughs> I love, I love the chicks. I do. Sparrows were a big part of my life too. Growing up, though, when I was very young, I used to watch them outside of my window. I had a huge, enormous maple tree um, outside of my wind bedroom window. And oh my goodness, the stories I spun when I was a little girl watching those sparrows making their nests year after year. Okay, I digress. Quick, quick, quick. I said it was going to be quick. All right, and they also use the yellow to match. All right, so this is the Fraser. Or Fra it's Fraser. It's Fraser. Here's my little card. We all know about this. Yeah, it did get beat up, and it was UPS delivery. Dang. All righty. Ooh, I got both the little logo, the chick, and I got a feather. Thankfully, they didn't get beat up. I laminate both, and I will use them somehow in my book. And, of course, there's the usual song and dance about the care. If I don't know how to care for these babies by now, I never will. All right. Oh! Okay, we're going on 2.15. All right, all right, here we go. They are still, thank goodness, using the, the um, bags. A lot of people were worried they wouldn't be using this nice soft stuff. Actually, I feel like maybe they might have changed the manufacturer just a tiny bit. This feels a little, not quite as soft as one or two of my bags. Eh, probably not. And no big deal anyway. It's a wonderful dust cover. Oh. Okay, I took that out way too fast. I should not have done that. I should have done it with more relish, more suavite. I know, no such word. Is that not gorgeous? Okay. Smelling, here comes my short hair. Oh, be careful. No getting any spittle on it. Whew. Wow. Oh, smooth. Smooth. If you don't know, guess, guess, guess. If you don't know, it's an A6. And I'm doing A6. I'm so happy that the um, stitching is not white. Because that's one of my issues with some of the TNs I have. It doesn't stay white. I beat my TNs up. I throw them around from bag to bag. They go from craft room to bedroom to desk to chairs to bed. I beat them up. And I'm so glad to have the darker stitching. Thank you, Jennifer. And black cord. Thank you. Because I'm not into the whole restringing thing. Too. I'm too lazy. Oh, wow. This is a deluxe. I do have an Outlander that's not deluxe. I like it. But there's just something about the pockets that I just like. I don't know why. Here's the pen loop. Interesting. So I've heard that you have to kind of train it a little bit. I, I don't think it's going to make much difference one way. I don't really care. As long as when you close the band, you know. Right. As long as it doesn't squash this, I'm fine. Oh, my gosh. Oh, so A6. I'm going to do A6 starting next year. Oh, I hope I can resist. Um, and I'm going to put a um, Hobonichi Techo in here and I'm gonna go from there and I want to keep this under five minutes and I'm doing it it's gorgeous you know it's it's cheek sparrow it's beautiful I absolutely love the color don't have anything like it um, now to just resist using it all the way until January 1st 2019 a sniff a day and I think I'll be okay <laughs>